Hey, this is Billy. Uh, welcome to tutorial number two on how to make a website for your church. Uh, last time we set up this simple website and today I'm going to show you how to make a photo album. So the first thing we want to do is uh, you go to your website. Uh, we named ours grapevine.tinypurplegrapes.com uh, so go ahead and you I typed that into my URL field already. So here we are at grapevine.tinypurplegrapes.com and we want to log in. So I enter the password and we're now in edit mode. Um, we need to turn on the photo album page. So over here are, there's four default web pages that come with every site automatically and I am going to turn on the photo albums page and I'm going to go to it. And this is what it looks like when you're in edit mode. And so the first thing we want to do is create a photo album. You can have mo multiple photo albums with different sets of photos. So this one I'm just going to call my, uh, let's call it, um, let's call it my pictures. And we click on create album. And so now we see we have my pictures down here. So I am going to, uh, now that we have the album created, I'm going to click on this and open it up in a new window. You, you don't have to open it in a new window, but it'll just be easier to show you guys, I think, if I do it that way. So we come over here, and there's no pictures in here yet. So I am going to pick a picture to upload. So I click on Choose Picture, and the first one is called Clouds. It automatically names it clouds here, but you can put whatever caption you want to in there. You upload it, and poof, there it is in your photo album. I'm also going to add one more picture. Alright, so there we have it. We got two pictures in our photo album. We can, uh, uh, if you're, as long as you're logged in, you'll see the photo album in this format where you can change the caption or uh, delete the picture. So now I'm going to uh, close this window and I'm going to log out. So now we see the website back the way it is when a visitor uh, when a visitor initially comes they'll come into the welcome page but you can go to the fo photo albums page click on the photo album and see your pictures with your uh, caption beneath. So that's all there is to it to create a photo album for your tinypurplegrapes.com website for your church. Next time I'm going to show you how you can change your photo album and turn it into a slideshow that will display up here in the logo area.